Remember, it's the dimples on a golf ball that cut down its drag and make it fly further. So by covering the clay with these... That's one dimpled car. If ever there was a car that looked like a golf ball, this is it. It might make the car more aerodynamic. This is by far one of the stranger things we've ever built. And to my mind, actually one of the most beautiful and not aesthetically either. I mean, to me, the beauty here is that we've taken the phrase golf ball-like effect on the car to the furthest possible point. No one can accuse us of not going far enough. Is this treatment gonna translate to better fuel efficiency? <laughs> I really don't think so. Will those dimples make a dent in the fuel consumption? 9,450 grams. That's our start weight. Well, by now you know the drill. Main tank solenoid is on. Let's go dip the car. Now. <laughs> but despite five runs at 65 miles per hour, the clay catastrophe never comes. So it's over to Adam. 8,972 grams. All right. Time to do a little math. What'd you get? <laughs> okay. The clay car with no dimples was 26 miles per gallon of change. The dimpled car, 29.65 miles to the gallon. <laughs> there is a golf ball like effect. I feel like eating my beret. But, uh, <laughs> I'm not gonna. That's awesome. <laughs> we totally didn't expect that result.